So this is my 2017 Nissan uh, X-Trail Tecna and this is the problem with the tailgate. Uh, try to operate it, the tailgate goes up nicely. And then comes back down. And if I try to use the button on the key fob, uh, nothing happens. The same with the button in the car and the only way to get it to uh, come back down again is to press the button on the inside and then it'll close as it should do. But obviously it's no good like that, you can barely get into the boot. So I've sent off for some uh, new struts from carlightbulb.com uh, and here we are about to fit them, so let's get cracking. I've removed the parcel shelf and the boot, the uh, boot floor. This is only the five seater. It's slightly different if you've got the seven seater. But on mine, the five seater, I've then removed a uh, single bolt from here, 10 millimeter, and the same at the opposite side. And then where the luggage straps fit, um, on the bottom at either side, you need to remove that. And that's done by um, removing or lifting the clip, if I can show it. Uh, this is the item, lift the clip and inside there's a 10 mil bolt. Uh, unscrew that and then remove it. Uh, I have propped the boot open with a piece of timber, as you can see. Next thing to do is to uh, pull out this panel as far as you can, undo the clips here and up at the top. So that's spragged back now as far as sort of halfway along the window. And the bottom one is pulled out as well, like so. That's so you can get your hands in into there, into the gap there, you just see the plug there, which needs to be disconnected. So the next thing to do is to remove the strut from its mounting up there. There's a clip that you pull out and then this just pulls off. The same down here. So I'll just show you. Another clip just down here that slides out and then that will pull off. Remove the rubber grommet from here so that you can pull the uh, cable out once you've disconnected it at the other side. So I'll go ahead and do that and then show you what it looks like. So I've now uh, pulled out the clip. Just under there you can see how it's just pulled out a little bit. So that's ready for that end of the strut to be removed and then the same needs to be done down here. Top end is off. And now you can get to the clip at the other end. Just there to pull that clip out. Other end removed. The uh, clip inside is separated, and you do that by pressing uh, pressing this clip in, and then pulling the two halves apart. So this is the old strut removed and here we've got a new pair of struts so the left hand side is a repeat of the right hand side it's quite uh, awkward getting into uh, into here to undo the plugs 
uh, and reconnect them. And I did actually lose one of these um, clips from there, somewhere down inside there. So I'm gonna have to buy a new one of those and replace it. But, um, and then once I'd um, uh, finished, uh, I did have to close the boot manually um, and then when it locked into position I can now um, use my uh, fob and uh, there we go, it's closing. And there we go, opening opening up to its proper height and staying there. Job done. Thanks for watching. I hope it's of assistance to some, someone.